tusks for today. Let's have a look and see what they are. This one says I need to manufacture some liquid sanity. Hmm, let's get the process going. I need to be in the kitchen at the coffee corner. Okay, so let's check the water level in the kettle. Ah, looks good. One, 1 1.5 liters. Ha, oh, good thing I, they reminded me to switch the kettle on. If the kettle starts to resemble a boy band member on a hot roof, switch off the heat source. Okay. Uh, let's see what's... Yes, yes, that all seems normal. Ah, gotcha. Okay. Good thing we had that video there. And I won't burn myself. Okay, 1.5 liters of water. Acknowledge and proceed. Let's see what's next. Okay, the preparation stage. Determine the required mug size based on the chart below. Yep, I'm going to have to take a large. Acquire the following in any fashion deemed legal according to local law enforcement. Teaspoon, sugar and coffee granules, milk. Okay can do that. Place one teaspoon of coffee granules into the mug. Place one teaspoon of sugar into the mug. Okay, done that. Pour milk into the mug until 20% of the mug has milk in it in order to achieve a one to four milk to coffee ratio. Yep, we got to get this right. Okay, ingredients acquisition results. Well, I wasn't arrested. I didn't mug anyone. Uh, no physical harm was caused to myself or others. Yeah, it was quite uneventful. Appropriate mug size selected? Most definitely. Enter your comments. All went well. Yeah, let's see what's next. Once the kettle is boiled, decant sufficient water into the mug from the kettle to achieve a 1, 1 to 4 milk to coffee ratio. Okay, pour. Stir three full revolutions clockwise. Okay, and three full revolutions counterclockwise. One, two, three. There we go. Okay, now I need to capture my facial expression before my first sip. Capture facial expression after first sip. Okay, let's have that sip. Done and dusted. Let's review. Everything looks right. Yes, we're done. 